Hi folks, welcome back down to the channel and I'm down here at the gorgeous Bradford Golf Club. This place is amazing. Uh, I'm here with my good friend Ben and I'm being stupid today by deciding to do a six hole challenge with him. So this is Potter vs Pro, episode one, hopefully season one of many. Let's crack on. Yeah, be good. Tell us a bit about yourself with Ben. Where are you from? What you do? I'm from Harrogate. I work at Rudding Park. I've played out of Harrogate Golf Club. I've been there a member for 15 years and I turned pro eight months ago. Eight months ago. And you're brand ambassador for Nilsson Clothing. I am indeed. As myself. Yeah. And you're also a member of the 2020 Pro Tour as well, aren't you? I am indeed, yeah. So Ben just recently turned pro. What did you turn pro off? Uh, I turned pro off plus one. Nice. And the pros here at Bradford have said to play from the 13th onwards because these are kind of the more picturesque holes. But I've got to say, so far, this entire golf course has been amazing, hasn't it? Yeah, it is amazing. just a stunning track, really, really stunning track. So we're going to play six holes and see, can I beat him scratch? This could be an absolute nightmare, couldn't it? <laughs> it after be fine, I'm sure. After we've played so far, this, this could be a, a danger. So it's a trial on my, on my channel to see if it goes and let's see what we can do. So here we go, 363 yard, par four, 13th. It's a lovely hole looking at this. It is mint. Is it, is it really good? Yeah, it's a good hole to start the vlog on. So Ben has played here previously a couple of times, haven't you? Twice. Twice. So he's got course advantage. <laughs> Ooh, he's carved it away. Move it into... Sit. Sit. Towards the bundu. Now, you've been playing boring golf all day and just fairways and greens, fairways and greens, and you've gone and done that on camera. Add into the drama, mate. I, I think it's it. a genius idea. Genius idea. Go on then, Rob. Let's see what you're made of. <laughs> Not a lot. You've said it today. Oh, I've got opposite side. Oh, this is going to make good viewing. Oh, this is going to be epic viewing. Folks, remember, like and subscribe, like and subscribe, and come follow us a bit more. If you, want to, if you want to see a fairway, like and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, Actually, like, don't come to this channel. Yeah, just don't, yeah, just don't, really, really don't, really don't. <laughs> so, ladies and gents, here we are. And that is Ben's ball. He's got 101 yards to the front of the green, according to my Arcos. So this is this is Spanish hands in Yorkshire. What could go wrong? Oh, you know what? Oh. That's so unlucky. That's so unlucky. It's just Fine. gone. There you go. Just in front of the bed. Oh, it's so unlucky. It flighted so well at first, didn't it? It was nice, yeah. Just it mint. I thought you did play an absolute worldie there. I just, I and did I'm as well. I'm really lying. glad you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> So we've got 121. Slightly better angle in than mine. Yeah, a little, you think? <laughs> a little <bit>. <laughs> <laughs> so 121 front, 140 middle. Oh, oh. thin the what's it's out of it. Skip it sandy, through the bunker. Sandy, gone oh, over on the over. green. Is that, 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 that didn't get through the bunker, didn't it? So it's, yeah, it's flicked over this bunker here. Got over it. I don't know if it's on the green or just short. I'll, I'll, nice I'll effort. Take it. I'll take it. Yeah. It's fine. It's fine. It's played for. It's a punchy shot. It's a punchy shot. Played it like a pro. <laughs> pro. Did you just describe it? You got the shot that you were going to play then. <laughs> so we were just looking. I thought, oh, is he going to be in the track marks here? Because they're doing some work to the course. They're doing a, a change to the tenth green and the tenth tee. So he thought he's in track marks. What what shot did you just say you're going to play there? I said, quote. I'm going to play a little sexy nipper for content. A sexy nipper for content. Wow. Sounds dodgy. Ladies and gentlemen, who doesn't like a sexy nipper? Go. It did, it did check up on you. It's just, yeah. Just probably more than you wanted. It'll work. It'll work. These greens are, I, I can't explain how good these greens are today, aren't they, mate? They are actually magical for this time of year. Yeah, they're, they're amazing. They're, they're, they're firm. They're not really denting up much, are they? No. Um, they're, they're, they're really quality, quality greens. And they're speedy as well, aren't they? Mm. They're, yeah, they're, they're quick. quite nippy. We're just interested in terms of how the breaks are at times, aren't we? We're just, we're, we've struggled a bit with reading the greens a little bit, aren't we, today? Yeah, a little bit. But yeah, yeah you'll, you'll, you'll see what they're going to be like now, anyway. 
So you just played your little sexy nipper, haven't you? Yep. All right, okay. I'll, I'll play my uh, unattractive fat, shall I? <laughs> it nipped just way too early and that's garbage. <laughs> All right, come How on. How many shots have I even had? Is this Papa? <laughs> eh, uh, it could be. If, if it feels like it's been a lifetime already, guys. And we're filming it, you know, you're watching it. It must be even worse for you guys. Here we go then. Oh, the greens run so well. I just put so poorly. <laughs> Low side's not the pro side, mate. Check out marker, by the way. Oh, let's have a look at the markers. These are the new ones you just bought, isn't it? Mm. Here we go. Oh, Lucy Goddard, if you're watching this, that is your ball marker all day long. Talk birdie to me. Where did you get that one from? Tag her in comments. Oh, we'll take a comments, I. <laughs> uh, I got them off eBay for a fiver. How many did you get for a fiver? Seven. Seven for a fiver with, with, with different markings on them? Oh, yes. That's mint. Not that far, right? We make it right, actually, this, aren't we, love? Yeah, we're doing well. We're doing well. So that's you for uh, this for Porgy. So, this to keep it level so far. Right, so here we go. We're at 163 yards, par, four, four, par 3, 14th up the hill. Pin is at the front. Got it by some strategically placed bunkers. What are you hitting, love? I have got six iron, uh, f seven iron. Seven iron. Got to go. Bit short. Just a little short. I got it 144 to the front of the green with my Arcos. So, <sighs> folks, you know I'm an Arcos ambassador, so in the link in the description below is a discount if you Love choose that. to want to go and uh, join Arcos. Hop on it, it is a good system. Thank you. It is. I, I, I love it. This data wise, it's fantastic, and just mm. yardage is great anyway on course, but data wise, it's fantastic. Right, so here we go. Six iron, up the hill. Let's hope. Drawing in now. Oh, he's on it. He's on it. Go. Oh, he's on it. Go. That is some form of sociable golf. First time today I've ever driven you. <laughs> <laughs> On a par three. Flags! Get in! Then <laughs> Chuck, what we got? What's, what, what's the thought? I've got 54. I want to chuck it about halfway there and just let it release. But it might happen, it might not. We'll see what happens. Oh, wizardry. Go. Wizardry. That's a great shot, mate. Oh, great thank shot. Thank you. Well played, pal. So Rob has got a very, very similar shot to mine, but he's playing it quite differently. Yeah, I'm going to play it with a nine iron. I'm just going to try and roll, run it up there. As we were discussing at the moment, I'm not. My short game confidence is not really high. It hasn't really been all year. But I just want to try and get on the ground and roll it up like a putt, if I can do. But again, this is just confidence for. Have I got the confidence to play these kind of shots? Oh, just checked on me. Uh, just nipped first bounce. So, this, because that's that's pretty much it. Well, by the way, we're not doing any gimmies on this. It's uh, it's all your shots. When I see every one drop. Yes. Aren't you guys lucky? Oh. Oh. I'm not going to lie, it's what he's been doing all day. Yeah, good putt coming back. Cheers, mate. Oh. Yep, 
Yeah, well then. Good part, mate. Good part. Thank you. So, he's now level still, and I'm one over. We're on the third of our challenge. 15th hole, 417 yard, par four. Go on, good drive, mate. Oh, that's that's in fourth. That's that's over the far far away with the gazelles, the giraffes, and a couple of lions, I believe. Well, I think I had a cow as well. Move then. The press of YouTube, ladies and gentlemen. Press of YouTube. If you want to test your metal, get on YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> or in your case, carbon wood. Hey. hey. <laughs> that's one for TaylorMed. You can have that one for free. Oh no. And he's gone the other way. Fight! Naked fairway. Naked fairway. Just look at that fairway. That's just shocking. Rob, step aside. Let me let me look at that fairway. Just virgin turf. <laughs> that we're nowhere near. This is horrendous. Is this the worst YouTube video in the world ever? Please comment below. <laughs> so, young Benjamin. Yeah. You just had the cheek to say this is what? A fairway. A fairway. What, so you class this as a fairway in reg? It's a fairway in reg. I've hit a fairway. When, it, when it's the next hole we're about to play. I've got a good angle in for the next as well, by the way. Wow. So, see, is this it? is the level of golf I'm playing against here, guys. This is just standards. So I'm getting 154 front, where are you getting the pin? 178 pin. 178, ooh. Just a touch pulley, but still good. Oh yeah, yeah, great shot. That's Focus not pretty, is it? That's, that's, that, there's just literally no shot there. I'm being very boring. I'm being very, very, very grey. Yeah. Yeah. Back in play. Sensible. Live another day. Fight another day. That's boring, what I'm doing. That's, boring, that's my boring. excuse. Boring. Yeah, boring. I might as well just wear a mauve coloured cardigan. <laughs> Everyone wanted it to go through. That tinsy wincy little gap there for the content, but no. Has anybody got any tofu? I think I need to eat some tofu. <laughs> yeah, I'd like to think Rob's got about 150 here. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> 152, the flag. <laughs> didn't even notice <laughs> Oh my god, what am I doing today? Oh, go. What, go, 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 go. Oh, That's a chance for par. There's a chance for par, ladies and gents. Car, We're content. having it. Oh, that's a great putt. It's a nice, simple lag. Boring that. Yeah, it was boring to be fair. <laughs> very square of you. Very, very square of you. We tried, Rob. What are we thinking? So Where's it breaking? What there's a little bit left to right on this. It's got a little bit of something on it. But I need I need a good roll on this one to train. Because you're, you're, oh, I've got two put here to be two down with only a couple to play. So I need a good put here. Oh, it was a good put. Stay up. Me. Oh, look at that go. That's, this is what we found all day, aren't we? Yeah. Just, I, it just, it can just go away from you so quickly on these greens. As Soon as you get past the hole, if you miss on the wrong side, it's see you later. It's, it's always a worry when the pro in the pro shop says, is this your first time here? And you go, yes, sir. Right, make sure you keep the ball under the pin at all times. That worries me when in October he's saying that to you. I did ask the question, but what if it's a front pin? And he said, just keep it short of the hole. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> if, you, if you miss the green on a short pin, miss it short. It's just, it's just the most bonkers way of thinking about it, but yeah. That's a solid putt, mate. 